Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the Raven's Mirth and an introduction to a new video series that I'm going to be starting called Let's Talk Story. Uh, my name is Nipua and I am so happy uh, you are here. Um, this, welcome to my garden um, and that you found me and my videos and my channel. Um, this new video series is to share my healing story uh, with you and the world, I guess, um, and what healing has meant uh, to me personally. Um, yep, to be honest, scared shitless. Um, it's like taking off your clothes and going to food for less, just FYI. Um, but in all honesty, um, fear has kept me silent, hidden, ashamed, um, and in a secret hidey hole that, um, has kept me isolated, um, despite my extroverted personality, my internal and I don't want to say hidden part of who I am, um, has been hidden for my entire life. Um, if you think this pandemic is isolating, um, try drowning in your own internal uh, black sea of emotional trauma and pain alone. Um, I started this channel with the intention to help those who are lost, broken, um, feeling alone, needing healing, um, not knowing what to do or how to do it because it's different for each of us. Um, that hopefully by sharing my stories, I can help someone, even if it's one person, um, to break free of what has been drowning them. I'm going to tell you right now, healing one person heals everyone around them. Um, ask my kids, ask my husband, ask my family and friends. They'll tell you. At some point, they'll be on here, but not now. Um... My goal today and with this particular series of Let's Talk Story is to shine light on those shadows, um, open the, help you open the boxes and um, for you to know that you're not alone, um, that someone truly does understand um, what trauma and pain and sorrow can do to you on the inside no matter what you show the world. Um, my sun sign is Capricorn my ascendant is Capricorn so what I show the world is very different than my moon sign which is Libra um, it also is a difficult balance uh, my sun sign is an earth sign and my moon sign is an air sign so internally I'm up in the clouds I'm floaty always trying to find balance and what I show the world is security balance foundation strength um, two totally different worlds. It's like having a split personality sometimes, FYI. Um, my healing and awakening journey started three years ago uh, when I hit my head on a commute train. I fell off the platform and in front of hundreds of people, I fell off the two foot platform and hit my head, went face first-ish into the train. Long story. I'll explain that in another video. There's a lot that goes into that story, so another video. Um, sorry, I have my notes <laughs> to keep me on track. Um, the stories I will share are, are emotional, um, traumatic, um, some joyous and and enlightening. Um, but the goal of the stories or the mission of this talk story series is to share a healing journey. Um, and what it has meant for me, uh, even though at times um, I don't know why things have happened to me, um, why I was meant to go through these, we'll say horrific things, I have finally figured out what value they came out of it. Um, and this healing journey is part of that purpose. Um, that healing journey 
is why I started this channel. Um, and all those things, as each video goes on, you'll learn or you'll un better understand what they meant to me as a purpose. And maybe those things in your life that feel horrible and traumatic, um, you can turn into something um, and turn them into something good and something that helps someone else. Um, because otherwise, it feels like those horrible things happened. Um, basically just to kill anything that was good inside of me. And it can't be. It, it can't be. Those horrible things, that can't be the purpose. Um, I'm not a psychologist. I'm not a doctor. Um, I don't have any self-proclaimed medical knowledge. Other than maybe coding. Um, uh, really, I'm just a one little empathic light worker um, on this earth plane with you, um, hoping to bring healing to humanity one heart at a time. Um, a very good friend of mine helped me see what needed to be healed, um, but she couldn't do the healing for me. Um, so I'm just sharing what she shared with me. I feel like it's the best way to repay what she did for me. Um, no matter how long it takes, uh, no matter how scared I am, um, no matter how much I want to go hide and not do this video or any of these videos or this channel, I have to. Um, something calls me to it. And if I don't, I feel that it, I'm not going to finish closing the healing of the trauma and pain. I mean, I'll always be healing. It always lives in you at some aspect. The narratives you hear in your head, the stories you tell yourself of why you can and cannot do things, um, what kind of person you supposedly are or aren't, um, or what measure you're supposed to meet. All those things are built from that trauma. All those things are built from those storylines that people told you and that you believe to be true. Um, trust me, I believe them. Um, Hopefully, my goal with this series is to touch someone's heart, help them find a new way of believing and seeing themselves. Um, and if I can, great. And if this series seems like something that you feel called to listen to, to heal with, um, that can bring you some type of maybe just support and maybe just a little love that you needed to hear that someone else has been through that trauma and hell too, um, please hit the like, subscribe, and notification button so that when this series um, new videos come out, you'll get them first. Um, my hope is by sharing my stories, my journey, my experiences, and that it can help you create a safe home um, that I can create a community of healing and a support system that we all need. Um, no one wants to air their dirty business out in the world. Uh, I guess that's what I'm doing now. Um, but I did it mostly alone. And I had to figure, out alone, figure it out alone. And it was really hard and really scary. And I really didn't understand. And I'm hoping that this channel, this community, these series can give you the brotherhood, sisterhood, humanhood to get through it and to ask questions or to bring your fears, put them down on anonymously, whatever it may be, um, but a place for everyone, anyone to feel supported and to feel safe. Um, this community is meant to be safe. So please don't bring anger, hate and frustration um, bring your questions if you're angry and hateful and frustrated. Ask for help. It's so important. And you may not even know you need help. Trust me. You'll understand what I mean as we go along. Thank you so much for showing up. Uh, for being present and connecting to the messages that resonate with you. And having an open mind um, and we will work through um, opening your heart um, and opening that next stage and what you can create in your life from healing. I love and appreciate every single one of you. Um, 
we don't need to know each other to love each other. Um, love is our gift and not only to ourselves, but to each other. And in a world of chaos, um, I'm just trying to bring the love that I've learned to bring out myself to the world and to those who need it and who are afraid to ask for it. Um, so know that um, I'm sending you so much love and healing and light. I'm hoping that it surrounds you always and even in your darkest hours or your brightest moments um, that that love you can feel. Um, I will see you all in the next video. Can't wait to dive in. Scared, but I'm gonna do it. And thank you guys so much for being here and for joining my channel. Namaste.